What's up, everybody? And welcome to another episode of Angela Eats TV Restaurant Review. Okay, today we are doing Vietnamese. Yes, you heard me right, Vietnamese. I want to thank everybody for joining me. And I welcome you all. To all my subscribers, welcome back. To all my new subscribers, welcome. And if you're so happy to be watching this video and you're not subscribed, please consider hitting that subscribe button down below and everybody leave me a comment. So we're going to go ahead and say grace and then I'm going to show you what I got, okay? Hashtag note to self, don't hurt yourself. This is Team Picky Palettes right here. And let's see if this get the hashtag Picky Palette do do stamp of approval. Father God, in the name of Jesus, I want to thank you for this meal that I'm about to receive. I ask that you let it be a blessing to my body. In this I pray in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, and amen to you. Okay, you guys. Okay, so what I got here today, right here, I have a green papaya salad. And it has shredded green papaya salad with shrimp and pork and a bunch of vegetables. So let's go ahead and take a look at this, why don't we? Can y'all see this? And it has some sauces and some peanuts and everything back here. It has some sauces here, sauces here, and it has another sauce over here. But look at that. You see the shrimp, you see the pork, and it has this land on a bed of uh, vegetables. So we gonna get into that. And then right here, let me see if I can get this laid out really good. I wasn't planning on shooting a video today, but I mean, Vietnamese is just something that I haven't done on my channel before, so I thought I better take advantage of the um, opportunity. So on the sandwich, I have a, um, a pork balmy sandwich, a barbecue pork balmy sandwich, and um, it's served on a French baguette. You can see this here. Try to get it in there. Look at there, look at there, look at there. And one thing I do appreciate that they put all the vegetables on the side so it wouldn't sog out the um, sandwich. So I have some uh, carrots, some shredded da daikon. I have some jalapenos in here. And they did give me um, some chili sauce right here. And um, they also gave me some so soy sauce. So if there's not enough vegetables or if I want some, but they, they give you a lot of meat. They're pretty generous. And this place, excuse me, Pho, Me, Cali, and Grill. Okay, and they are, there's that overview. They are located at 1635. Sweetwater Road in National City. Okay, and again, this is called Fa My uh, Fa Me or My M A I Cali and Grill. Okay, so let's go ahead and get this dress and pause. If you don't got a snack, go get you a snack and come right on back. Okay. So yeah, you guys, we're doing Vietnamese food today. I am on a roll for real. So I'm gonna get all these veggies in here. I love veggies. Get them spread it out. Get my little carrots. So how's everybody doing? I hope all is well with you. I hope you are blessed. Ooh, look at they got some nice look at the slices of these jalapenos. Oh my and I'm gonna go ahead and try a piece before I add any uh like soy sauce or anything like that on it. But um I got a topic today, y'all. I really do. So I might as well take advantage. I think I wanna bite it from this side, but Take a look at that, y'all. Isn't that beautiful? Isn't that beautiful? Look at that. A balmy sandwich, a pork balmy sandwich. So let's go ahead and I'm gonna take the tip of this bread off because I want to get all meat. Mm. 
Mm, 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 mm. Mm, mm. Wow. Look at all this papaya. I've never had a papaya salad before. You guys see that? Fresh mint. There. But I'm going to put some of this chili sauce right here on my sandwich. Mm -mm 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 -mm. But you guys, now y'all know I don't like to get deep on my channel about nothing. And I don't speak on things too often unless it just really actually moves me. You know what I mean? But I'm going to talk about, Lord forgive me, politics, okay? And I'm, I'm not going to get all deep into, of, you know, what party you with or, or all of that or whatever. All I want to touch on, to tell you the truth, is that please if you're not registered please go vote please go vote and the thing and the thing with it you know you know people you know I understand that we're really busy let me try it with this chili sauce on it I love this baguette because it's it does the bread's not soggy Mmm. Look at that, guy. Mmm. 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 That's all I was saying. I understand that we're busy. And you are registered to vote. But if you're moved, or maybe you missed a year or skipped a year or whatever about voting or whatever, you could do everything online. You got plenty of time right now. We got 74 days. By the time you get that, it'll be around this video. It'll be around 70 days or 71, somewhere up in there. You know what I'm saying? But go online and see what your status is. And if you move, you know, you need to update so you can get your ballot through the mail. You can vote through the mail. You can do anything. And with the mail system, you know how, you know, um, they playing games with the postal service and stuff right now. You can still get your ballot in the mail. And then you could call the local polling area in your in your um, particular area, and you could go drop it off. You ain't got to stand in line. You ain't got to do none of that. But you know what? You know y'all may not see eye to eye with me, but y'all remember the feeling that we felt when Barack Obama got elected. Do y'all remember that? Mm-hmm. This is good. It's so fresh. It's extremely fresh. Ooh, that chili. Mm. Mm. Mm, 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 mm. So good. Ooh. But do y'all remember that feeling and the energy throughout the United States when Barack Obama got elected president? That was history in the making. History, bar none. It was electrifying. Can't deny it. But this election right here, that is history. 
but this is life or death. Y'all hear me. I don't care which way you go. You make sure that your voice is heard. Because just when like Michelle Obama said, if I don't know if you watched the Democratic National Convention or not, but like she said, it's bad right now. And if you don't think it could get no worse, sit on your hands. It's going to get a lot worse. You need to make sure that your family members, your nieces, your nephews, your son and daughters, if they are of an age, you need to make sure that they sit down and register on vote. They don't have to go stand in line for hours. They don't have to do none of that. It don't take five minutes to register online. Not five minutes. Not five minutes. But you need to make sure that everybody in your immediate surroundings, in your circle, to go out and vote like your life depended on it. Because you know why? It does. You know what, I don't have a big platform. And if this just breaches and registers with one person, I'm good. I'm, I'm good. Do your due diligence. I am so, so serious. Because we are in a state right now, everybody, is in a state right now. Hashtag alone together. Do you really understand what that statement is saying? Because we have been abandoned. Who do Jesus? Look at this shrimp, y'all. Shrimp on on this papaya salad, got some crispy garlic. Okay, I gotta taste these sauces because I don't do good with sweets. I have a very sensitive system. And that's a, and that's a little sweet. Let me try this one. I thought papaya salad was supposed to be spicy. You know, I might have to eat this. Buy me a different dressing to eat with this, you guys. Because I can't do sugar. I really, really can't. And it's sweet. Darn it. And I and I do, I apologize for that. For those of you that, you know, do not know that I have a severe sensitivity to sugar and to sweetness. And when I say severe, I mean severe. I cannot do sugar at all. And just dipping my finger in it like that, that's a little much for me. Yeah. So I'm not gonna be able to eat this salad, but I could come back and do another mukbang with this salad. And uh, because it's it's too much, and or, you know what I may am gonna do? I'm gonna put some of my shrimp in here. <laughs> put some. Um, well, I already got pork in it, but let's go ahead and put some. In. And you know what? They slice the shrimp in half. 
you know um, this sandwich has a whole lot of freshness into it that chili sauce that they send with it is perfect it, it blends everything together there's a whole lot of crunch factor and everything but this Fa Me Cali Grill is the Fa Me Cali Grill in National City. This gets the hashtag boom boom stamp of approval. Hickey Palette stamp of approval. Y'all see that? But I wanted to, you know, I was finna eat something. I never did Vietnamese food before. And I had something on my mind that I felt like that I could share. You know what I'm saying? I, I wanted to get the, you know, and I know we all responsible adults or whatever. But, you know, even we being sponsored uh, adults, we get lazy. Mm, mm, mm. I want y'all to sit down. And it's not so much as getting lazy as we get busy. And this really needs to be in the forefront of our minds because this is our lives. This is our children's lives. This is good. I'm definitely eating here again. I love vegetables. Love vegetables. Love, 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 love vegetables. The meat is nice and tender, nice and flavorful. Because I tried this sandwich, y'all. See, I tried this sandwich even before I even put vegetables on it. And that barbecue pork is really good. Now, the pork that's on this papaya salad is not barbecued at all. I don't know why I thought papaya salad. Maybe that's Thai. Was supposed to be um, spicy and not sweet. More spicy and, and um, vinegary. You know, more of a vinegary base. This is this is sweet. I taste a little hint of vinegar in the in this in one of these particular sauces or whatever. But combining the two, I'd be sleep. And wouldn't even know that I went to sleep. I, I just, but I'm gonna I'm get me a balsamic or something like that to eat with this, cause I want to eat that salad. I love salad. Well, shoot, it's been what twenty minutes already. One of these times, I'm going to get on here and finish something. I doubt it, but I'm going to try. But you know what time it is. Yeah, you know what time it is. If you're happy here, you know it. What you know about that? Mm -hmm. I want to thank you guys for all of your support. Um, I want to thank you guys for watching my videos to take the time. I know we, you know, we always we have other friends on the YouTube block that we try to just spread ourselves around and try to go visit everybody. So I thank you. I thank you. I thank you. I thank you for do stopping by. Um, anybody, you know, um, I do got t-shirts available. It's in the description box below. You know, I'm trying to keep my channel going and trying to move on and and do some things because I want to get some traveling, traveling in. And I'm waiting on all things Lolly because she coming. Hi guys, and welcome back for another video. Now I'm gonna go ahead and dive into this burger. Mm. Woo. She is coming and I'm so excited. So yeah, I'm saving my pennies because it's gonna be a treat. I can't wait to meet her. But, uh, 
You can like me. You can hate me. You can love me. You can totally ignore me. But whatever you do, you introduce me to somebody. But before all that, you do you. Because I'm damn sure doing me. Boom. Until the next episode of Angela East TV Restaurant Review. And like I said, Fa, me, Cali, and Grill gets the hashtag Piggy Palace Step of Approval. Doom, doom. Deuces.